Prosecutors say she had a suspended license but was still behind the wheel. That 24-year-old Milwaukee woman is now charged in a crash Thursday night that seriously injured a pedestrian. Bill Miston live tonight with new details about the woman's history of traffic violations. Bill? Yeah, I'm here at Holton and Capitol where this all unfolded. And court filings say that a Milwaukee cop witnessed it all, saying that a car was heading eastbound here on Capitol when it swerved around traffic, stopped at a red light, only to hit a car that was tr trying to turn left, and then careened into this bench, hitting the bench and pinning a 60-year-old man underneath that vehicle. Uh, it happened shortly before 9 p.m. Thursday night. 24-year-old Kellis Edmonds is charged with felony reckless driving, causing great bodily harm. And knowingly operating while suspended. The man needed to be pulled out, and filings say he may lose his leg. Police arrested Edmonds as she was walking away without checking on the man. And court records show she had her license suspended last summer, was found guilty in municipal court for running a red light this past spring, and has state dr and has state traffic convictions for driving without insurance, for an unregistered vehicles, and driving while suspended. It's unclear if Edmonds has an attorney who could speak on her behalf. She remains in custody and is yet to appear for her initial appearance in this case. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News. So she was walking away not only from the person who was hurt, but from the whole scene, Bill? That's what it appears. In, in, in court filings, it says that the police officer got out of his vehicle to obviously check on the situation and the man that was pinned and saw, uh, according to court filings, Edmonds walking away, and that's when the police officer stopped her. Bill Misson reporting live tonight. Thanks for the follow-up.